Hey there guys, my name is Marquez and in this video I'll show you step by step how you can easily use whiteboard or collaborative whiteboard in monday.com. So the first thing that we are going to do, I'm going to click here add. Then I'm going to choose choose from templates. Now here I will write search all templates and I'm going to write whiteboard. I will click on it and then use template. creating our first template. Okay, here we are. So automatically it's going to um, like going to be created. Now you can see right here collaborate whiteboard app will be uh, deprecated soon. Try canvas by monday.com. So this is uh, like a thing that I recommend for you to use too. And I'm going to create a tutorial on how you can use the canvas, workcanvas.com. But before that, I'm going to show you how we can use this here. So what you can do here and how we can work with it. So first thing first, I can like choose if I'm going to have multiple items here. Then I have option to, to add a text or add a line here. Look at this. So let's say I'm going to have a red line. So I can like easily draw stuff. And then I can simply like look at this. I can choose the elements and delete them. So if I'm going with mouse and hover over like the smile and the road that I created, I can delete those. So this is how we can simply use it. Now, if I go even further, what I can do here, I can add a text and I can start writing. So I can write, let's say, okay. You can make it bigger. You can easily delete it. Again, I choose it and press delete it. So I go like this. See, I can go again this and start writing. Hi there. This is me. Hi there. This is me. Look, and this is how you do it. You need to a little bit play around with it, but that's how we do it, right? So when I go here also, I can again draw or I can upload an image URL and like add it here. So that's what you can do. But again, as I feel that you should definitely tr try the canvas by monday.com and focus on that. And I'm going to show you also in this video how we can use it. But if you're completely new here, um, get started free and I'm going to show you. Okay, this account that you get directly connected to your account and get started. And I'm going to show you how we can do directly in this video because this is a little bit limited on what you can do here. Like, yes, you can collaborate with other people, but I believe here you would have multiple options here, what you can do. So first thing first, a work canvas, you can have uh, the templates. <clears throat> so let's say mood boards, what analysis, flowchart, or you can go simply and click blank canvas. And here you got, as you can see, multiple options comparing to normal whiteboard on monday.com. So you can select, you can move, you can add a template, you can add a text. So I can add a text and right here, hi there, how are you doing? So I can change the size of it and I can line it up or I can make it bold or you can change the text color. So that's what you can do here. Now I can add a sticky note and you have option to add uh, various colors of your sticky notes. So let's say I'm going to add uh, like, let's say like this and this 
And again, you can change the color. You can change the text color. You can change also the size of it and make it bold. Then I can add a connector. So let's say I'm going to have multiple sticky notes, one, two, three. And what I can do, I can simply use a connector and like connect one object with the other. Then next is pen. So I can draw. Yeah, I don't know really how to draw a heart, but my heart is full of love. <laughs> and then you're going to find shape here. So in the shape, you have option to add a circle, a square. Many things here. So you can add simply I like the, those diagrams. So these are the shapes. Then you have tasks here. So let's say I have a task and I'm going to zoom in. Select and this is my task. And look at this. I can on the task in a canvas, which is connected to monday.com. I can easily uh, choose a task color. I can add a tax. I can add a signee or due date. So uh, then you're going to find also the frame here. And in your frame, I can add multiple objects. So let's say I'm going to move. I'm going to select. I'm going to edit here. I'm going to select and I can move everything with my frame. So this is how we do it. The last thing is you can add an image or I can simply add a new canvas. So this is how you can also work with work canvas. This was like the introduction tutorial. Uh, in the next tutorial, when you would write like Canvas Pro, you would find um, my tutorial again on YouTube and you can find like everything there that I was doing. So thank you very much guys for watching. If you're gonna have any questions, ask me down below in the comments. I'll be really happy to help you. And this is pretty much it how you can use the whiteboard. The whiteboard is a little bit limited in my opinion here in Monday. But it's much better in work canvas. So thank you. Have a great day and goodbye. See ya.